Hello and hi everyone! Welcome back to day two of designing an island using only one color! Tom Nook here has some announcements for us, so let's get into it. As of this very day, a brilliant fellow by the name of Blathers will be joining us on Sandy Blue. Very nice, our little bird boy's here. Also, I would just like to point out that it's raining. Good sir, go inside! Do you want to get electrocuted? So, some things that I want to talk about very briefly. Uh, first thing, I bit my tongue. I have a bit of a lisp going on, pardon that. Also, blue shell, nice. Another thing is that yesterday we actually finished all the nook miles that we needed to upgrade our house. As you can see, we have our beautiful house with our blue roof. Honestly, it looks really good. I like it. All right, so we have some nook miles here that I would like to gather. Thank you. Oh, I probably should put everything in my house storage now that I have some. I will go do that in just a second. I don't know what I have in store for today. I don't really know what happens. I keep forgetting what happens after you complete all your nook miles. I think you go talk to Tom Nook and he tells you to do a bunch of stuff. But you know what? Sure, we'll do that. I also would like to get KK Slider on my island as soon as possible. Well, oh wait, we have our packages here. Oh, my sandals. Yes, let's go. Look at them. I am repping some nice blue sandals. Hope you guys like. Okay, let's just put stuff away now. I also need to get a lot of money, but in order to do that, I need a shovel so I could get the money tree and bury it a bunch of times. Oh, and I have to go say how to Blathers too. Is he even here? Oh yeah, he is here. Okay, well, I'm gonna take these things and donate it to him. I don't know how many I need more. I think I need 15 in total. I don't know how many these are, so I'm I'm just, I'm gonna give it to him and he's gonna tell me. Hi, Blathers, silly little owl. Luckily for you, Blathers, I have a bunch of fish and bugs to donate to you today. And I hope, I think I have to complete everything, but I hope you give me the vaulting pole and a shovel. That would be very nice. Oh, there we go. Okay, wow. I thought you had to give all the fish first, but no, apparently not. And a shovel. Okay, very nice. Thanks, Blathers. All right, have this beetle. I know what you're gonna tell me. Yep, I knew it. I said in yesterday's video that this was literally Blathers' job to take in bugs and he's disgusted by it, but like my guy. If you really don't like bugs, don't work with them. Why do you do this to yourself? I don't understand. This time we'll give you a diving beetle. You know what, Blathers? Tell me about it. I want to know about the diving beetle, the big chunky guy. The dastardly diving beetle, famous for its distinctive round shape. This powerful predator uses thick back legs covered in hairs to paddle after its prey. That's terrifying. And it uses suction cups on its front legs to grip its quarry from- Okay. okay. Suddenly I don't like the diving beetle anymore and I understand why Blathers is scared of it. Wow. My own legs have gone weak thinking about it. Yeah. I mean, honestly, if that swam at me in the water, <laughs> I, would, I would die. My life over. All right, have this eel instead. Suddenly, this just reaffirms my thalassophobia all of a sudden. I really do not like open water. You know what the thing is though about thalassophobia? It's not the fish that scare me. Well, they do scare me regardless, but it's not that that scares me. It's the unknown in the water. Like what if like a giant shark just comes un underneath me and eats me, you know? Okay, well, I guess that does have to do about the creatures, but still it's terrifying. It's like, you don't know what's in the ocean. Like we don't even know what's half in the ocean, let alone like 10% of the ocean. Apparently we know more about space than we do of our own oceans and that terrifies me. Why do people want to go underwater? Just leave it at that, okay? We don't need to go underwater. We're made to go on land, okay? We don't need to submerge ourselves underwater. I'm sorry if you like water. I'm just, I'm such a hater and I remain that way. Anyways, <laughs> enough about my tangent. <laughs> Let's move on. Unfortunately for me, I gotta keep donating so I'll just be a second here. I'll catch up when I'm done, okay? I promise. Okay, we need six more donations so I guess I'll get to that today. Uh, More importantly, let's go talk to Tom Nook, see what he has for me today and then we'll do our like other activities. They're talking. Oh, is this about Timmy and Tommy's nook shop? Oh, it is. Uh, okay. So Tom Nook just talked about my house. Yeah. Thank you, my guy, for the house upgrade. But like I said, I don't have the funds. Um, yeah, sure. Take the money that I have. A nook mile ticket. Wow. We could go on our first freaking villager hunt. Oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait. I really want the four villagers that I put on the, the to get list, which is I think Ali, uh, <laughs> uh, Jeremiah. Maya. Okay, I forget the two others, but I really want them. But honestly, if I get any other blue character or a character that has like blue on them, that's pretty good for me. Technically, Pashmina has blue on her horns. Uh, It's not the overall color blue. I would like to find another villager with more blue on them. But Goose, like, oh my goodness. Goose has like the cutest little shirt. It is blue, but it's not technically like his, I guess, feathers because he doesn't have fur. He's he's a bird. Ooh, okay. We're going to get the ring, the tool ring, because it's very annoying pulling out my tools through my storage. So I totally just ignored what Tom Nook told me. Uh, I think he was just talking about Nook Miles and whatever. Okay, but what do we do? You know, what should I do? This is a good timing, actually. I've been meaning to talk to you about Timmy's shop. Or rather, I've been meaning to point you in Timmy's direction. He should have the details for you. Wait, I'm building the shop now? I feel like that's so soon. Don't I build, like, the bridge first? Or... <laughs> 
literally any other plot. But sure, I'll do it. Ah, uh, yes, we need all the materials. Should I just go to Nono Island and get the materials? <laughs> Cause like, mm, I'm kind of like side eyeing this right now. Like, oh God. Uh, yeah, I'll help. I'll help, honestly. Okay, 30 pieces of basically everything. Ah, uh, okay guys, this is a big decision for me. Am I gonna be a big girl and do it on my own or go to Nono Island and get everything? <laughs> I mean, while I'm there actually, I could pro- Oh, wait, no, my airport's not open yet, is it? Hold on, let's go check this puppy out. Oh, airport, Orville, the other one. I forget. Hi, Orville. Very nice to meet you, by the way. I want to know, can I go places? I know I could go to a Nook Mile, or sorry, my bad, villager hunting right now, but that's not what I want to do. I just want to know if I could go cheat a little. Oh, wait a minute. I want to fly. Stop talking about the freaking Nook Mile. I don't want to go see a villager right now because I can't. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to go to a Nono Island just to gather a couple resources. Don't mind me. <laughs> I will just be a second. I can't show it obviously because I don't want to get people in trouble. So yeah, I will see you in just a second. I'm honestly surprised you could go to these already in the beginning of the game. I'm on my second day. All right, where is it? There it is. Resources, yes. I think I'll take two of everything. Ah, oh, beautiful Nook Miles. Look at all of them. Okay, well, listen, I'm gonna take Nook Miles because I know I'm not gonna be able to get any. So we'll grab like a, a stack of five, I would say. Yeah, that sounds good. <gasps> Forbidden crap. I think this is going too far. I am not gonna grab that. All right, well, this was nice. I'm skadoodling now. I don't need to be here anymore. Ooh, I'm actually curious. What does my island look like when you fly in? I should host a beach party on my island. Oh, wow, we. Okay, not bad so far. Um, it's something, honestly. Also, I have an eyelash in my eyeball. That's fun. All right, well, since we have the stuff, let's go donate it to Timmy and uh, be on our way. Hi, I totally didn't just go to a no-no island. Here you go. Love you. Okay, this is what he's giving. He's giving a bottle chip, a sewing machine, and a beaded curtain wall. Ooh, interesting. Thank you. You're going on the beach. <laughs> Banished to the beach. I mean that with love. <laughs> I swear. Oh, I should have placed the museum on the beach. I don't know why I didn't do that. I feel silly now. Oopies. Get out of my way. How you doing, pillow? Do you want to go inside? It's kind of rainy. Ah, he's chilling. He's fine. Home, sweet home. Let's put everything away. Oh, let's place the beaded curtain wall. Wow. All right, vaulting pole time. I can't wait to explore my island. Gosh dang it, I have another hair in my eyeball. What the heck? Guys, keep it together on the eyeball. <laughs> it's actually quite painful. Uh, ignore me. <laughs> Thank you for the encouragement, guys. I really, I really appreciate it. He has fleas. Nasty boy. What the? Excuse me, sir. That is not A-OK. -okay. That's right. <laughs> I got you cornered. There was a flea on me? Yeah, they're bad this time of year. Thanks, Puplin. Are they though? I mean, <laughs> I think you're the only one, my guy. Enough about that. Let's finally- Oh, we're gonna ignore that for today. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'll go back to him eventually. Just not right now, okay? Let me do my job. So Timmy and Tommy will go- Yeah, I would say right here. We want to save enough room for everyone else because all the houses are going here. Nice! And now we can collect everything on the beach. I know there's a couple DIYs with like seashells and stuff, so I want to collect them and hopefully if there's anything in blue, I can craft it and put it on my island somewhere. I am now realizing <laughs> I'm probably gonna have to destroy these cliffs at one point and that's gonna be awful. <laughs> Just truly awful. Uh, not a excited for that. I remember having to do that for Doodle Puppin. Oh my goodness. I just, oh, <laughs> I couldn't stand it. Three hours of just tearing things down. Anyways, enough about that. Oh, look, a little money. You know what I should do, actually? I should invest in one of those donation boxes so that my villagers can kind of give me a bit of money. That would be nice. Let's dig this money up, bury it again, and uh, let's go check how much the donation box is and also talk to Tom Nook about what we should do next. Okay, let's see. Where do I even get the objects yet? I don't think so. Well, <sighs> All right, then. Never mind. I will just go talk to Tom Nook. What should I do? Is that it? Is that all I'm doing today? He's like, oh, I, I should be more like you doing all the building and stuff. Excuse me. I want to progress further. What the heck? Also, can I just be the first to say that those mugs look so edible? <laughs> I just want to crunch them, you know? Well, I guess since we're just going to do whatever for the rest of the day, let's go do whatever for the rest of the day. Let's go draw on our board because we're little artists over here. Little artist. How about we do my fear? the bug, the diving beetle. All right, let's fill this bad boy with water. Let's go. Cute, epic music. Honestly, the sound that the pencil makes against the paper is, oh, ASMR. Just a little guy, just a little guy. Okay, but we gotta draw his gross legs. What did it look like again? Wasn't it like hooks or something like that? I think something like that. <laughs> something like that, sure. Yeah, that works. <sighs> 
he's beautiful. Anyways, let's move on. Dancing time. I bet you guys liked this activity yesterday. Let's stretch. Oh, we have more people today with this. Nice. Okay, motion it is. Watch me, watch me crack my shoulders again. Begin. Okay, everyone, get ready. I don't actually know what this motion is. What is this? Am I just like trying to do a jumping jack? Oh, twirl. Get those uh bones cracking, guys. Very good for your, your body, I bet. Very good, guys. All right, to the left, I think. To the right. Oh, I'm doing the opposite. To the to the right. <laughs> I don't know. Just pick a, pick away. Twist, twist. I got a shimmy in my chair. Out, out. <laughs> shimmy again. Go, shimmy. There we go. All right, long stretch. Up, up, up. There we go. Let's stretch those little little arms, guys. Yeah, get a good get a good burn in those limbs. Very good. Whoa. <laughs> very good. Very good. Okay, one more time. Good job, everybody. Look at you go. All right, the one I can't do. Go, jump, go. Probably because I'm sitting down, but I'm trying. Okay, there we go. End it all off. There we go. And perfect. We'd, oh, one more time, sorry. <laughs> there we go. Good job, everybody. That was something. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, Well, since we don't have anything else to do today, I'm pretty sure we could just time skip and kind of go on our way, you know? I will see you guys there. It's raining again. Ugh, gross. Nice goose has a cute umbrella. Oh, <gasps> Pride Month. Yes, goose representing. Oh my God, we love an ally. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Tom. Again with you standing outside with the microphone. Go inside. You're gonna hurt yourself. Timmy and Tommy opened up their shop today. Very nice. Uh-oh, phone call. I am just now realizing his fur's all wet. I feel bad. You know what I just totally forgot about yesterday? I forgot about Gulliver. That was not intentional. I feel bad. But Sahara's here. Oh my gosh, Sahara. <laughs> I don't think I'm actually gonna buy anything from her today because I don't have that much money. For now, it would probably be best if I just didn't spend a lot of money on random stuff. I have a feeling like Tom Nook's gonna talk to me about building a bridge. I would love to build a bridge right over here. It's the perfect spot to get to Timmy and Tommy. Our boys. They're little businessmen now. Oh my god, it's Mabel. Bye, Mabel. It was nice meeting you for like a quick sec. Anyways, uh, so I'm looking at the goods here. I don't see anything that's beach themed necessarily. Like nothing will help me with the building process. There's nothing blue either. So I'm just gonna go to here. Oh, we could get a diving suit. It's not blue though. Aqua flooring. Oh, I was thinking actually to make my house into like maybe a spa resort. Thanks guys. I'm gonna go talk to Tom Nook now, figure out what I need to do. It's probably the whole bridge situation. All right, so three people are interested in moving on my island. That's great. I love to hear that. Hopefully they're just blue characters because <laughs> it's gonna make it extra hard for me to kick them off. I should know that this is how it works. I I honestly forget each time I restart how this game plays out. It's kind of sad, honestly. Oh, wow. Hello. <laughs> What's up? Oh, reaction time. Nice. I get to learn reactions. Um, Pashmina, <laughs> you're kind of in the way, girl. All right, so we got to build the bridge. Like I said, I'm going to place it by to me and Tommy. Why is it so chunky? Just out of curiosity, I want to catch it. I know I'm in the process of building the bridge right now, but I just, I want to see. Well, I want to know if I could even catch it. Oh, that's so disappointing. <laughs> it's so disappointing. I have the log stakes. I can finally build the bridge entirely. I'm honestly hoping when they come out with the new switch that they'll be like, oh, by the way, Animal Crossing, we either have like a new game entirely or they're like, oh, here's an update. A huge big ol' update to Animal Crossing New Horizons. I didn't mean to fish, sorry. <laughs> that would be the dream, honestly. Why did I come in here again? I don't need to be here. I need to place down the bridge. <laughs> Why did I forget? Smooth brain, small brain, little raisin brain. Oh, <gasps> it fits too. It was meant to be, guys. This is the spot. Yippee, we did it. Nice. Okay, well, we got Nook Miles off of that. Very good. Let's go talk to Tom Nook. Maybe he'll have other things for me to do too. Hey, <laughs> I'm back. I did find a good place for it. You'll love it when you see it if ever you go outside. We get the housing kits already? That was so soon. Oh, do we do them today? Oh, and then we could go for a small little villager hunt? <gasps> mm, I think so. You know what? We'll take it one house at a time. I'm not gonna do all three houses at the same time because I don't want random villagers moving in, you know? I wanna go find them. Okay, so let's place down house number one on the beach. We're gonna go, uh, yeah, we're here. Perfect. Nice little spot for them. This is plot one. Place down. Holy heck, that's a huge space. Perfect. This is the spot. All right, everything is built. So now we get to go villager hunting. I'm gonna go grab some tickets. Uh, empty out my pockets just a little bit. Hopefully we can find either a dreamy that I want. Oh, I guess we'll have 11 tickets. Tom Nook did give me another ticket. So 11 villager hunts we go. Okay, first island. Ooh, and it's not raining. My favorite. <laughs> Let's see who it is, guys. Cross our fingers. This sets off what the mood is gonna be like for the rest of the villager hunting. All right, Wilbur. Okay, okay. I get it. I get it. Oh, 
wait, 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 wait. They have blue on them, Dora. Oh, wait a minute. I had beef with you at one point. I remember that. Dora is actually one of my friend's favorites. This is a good start. What the heck? You know what? I'm gonna do it. I know this is just the first ticket, but I want to save them for other ones too. Welcome, Dora. <laughs> Welcome to my island. We're gonna have to give you a tropical shirt there, but it's fine. My friend's gonna be so happy about this. I'm gonna let him know too. All right. Well, that was very short. I hope we all liked that. Anyways, uh, oh, coconut trees. Oh, <gasps> yes. Let's take them. I do need coconut trees. I think I'll just take their coconuts, not the actual tree. We have a, a bottle on the beach somewhere. That would be nice. No bottle on the beach. Very sad. Gonna smash some rocks here. Do you guys like my socks and sandals? <laughs> I can just tell that my feet are covered in sand on the inside. No doubt about it. I kind of wish we came across an island with windflowers instead of mums. Oh well. I am quickly going to shake these trees so I don't get stung. I would not like to get stung, please. Please don't hurt me. Oh no. Oh, that landed right on me. What the heck? Game is trying to sabotage me. Rude. Oh, wait. Items can fall from trees on islands? Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that. Fan palm. I really want to do the second plot for the villager, but I have to keep it for other days because I have to end the recording soon. It's almost been like two hours. <laughs> I tired. I probably should double check with Dora to see if that she's actually moving on my island. Just in case. I feel like I've done that in the past where I just left without actually talking to the person that I wanted. Get this wasp out of here. Oh, wait. I need it though. Fine. You shall remain in my pocket for now. Dora. Okay, so she is moving. Perfect. Well, let's go home. We don't need to be here anymore. Thank you, Island, for all your resources. It was very nice of you. Double making sure, triple making sure that Dora's moving on my island. It doesn't say. Oh no, what does this mean? Oh no, what does this mean? Is she actually moving on or not? Guys, did I screw up already? What happened? I guess we'll only find out tomorrow. But for now, I shall end the day. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If it's your birthday today, happy birthday. And if it's not your birthday today, happy day. I will see you guys tomorrow. So love y'all. Take care. I cannot say bye-bye. Oh, I can say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Please, Dora. Please.